Hey everyone, Joey here with a quick news roundup, starting with a leak of a new Sonic mobile game called Sonic Toys Party, which has been compared to Fall Guys. This was reported by Sonic Stadium, who got the leaked trailer from Sonic Show on YouTube. We won't show any footage, but we'll describe what we saw in the trailer. For one, the game's logo looks a lot like Toy Story, which makes sense, I just hope no copyright laws are being broken here. The game has dozens of players race to the finish line, playing as their favorite characters like Sonic, Tails, Knuckles, Amy, Shadow, Rouge, and Eggman. They go through various stages like Green Hill Zone, racing to the finish line. Though it's been compared to Fall Guys, the gameplay still looks like a Sonic game, with high speed, grind rails, and homing attacks. Does that sound fun at all to you? Let us know in the comments. Now then, let's get to some juicy Nintendo Switch 2 rumors. Nash Weedle, who previously reported that a Spanish studio has received a Switch 2 dev kit, has stated the following on Twitter. The Switch 2 development kit receives an important update. Now the tools allow us to go one step further. I confirm that this is direct information from a developer, it is not speculation. Opinion. I think the update is in reference to rescaling. So yeah, this is a pretty vague update, but he believes that this so-called big step forward is about rescaling, or rather upscaling, such as with AMD FSR or even better, NVIDIA DLSS. Even current Switch games like Tears of the Kingdom utilize upscaling with FSR, as the current Tegra X1 chip is not capable of DLSS. We'll just have to wait and see what the Switch 2 is capable of, and hopefully we will know if the console gets announced later this year. So keep it locked to Game Explained by subscribing and hitting that notification bell for more Switch 2 news and rumors. Until next time, bye bye